Climate-related shocks such as droughts, excessive rainfall, pests and diseases deprive small-scale farmers of education for their children, reduce their dietary diversity and drive them to sell off productive assets. For these reasons, crop insurance complemented by other risk-reducing practices can be a sustainable approach to unlock investments in agriculture for smallholders that improve their resilience and productivity. Picture-based insurance, PBI, a crop insurance, protects farmers against financial risk posed by extreme weather events and has been widely advocated as a tool to help farmers' households escape poverty traps and invest in climate-smart, high-productivity agriculture. PBI relies on images taken by champion farmers on the silt grow up to show crop damage caused by extreme weather conditions. By taking the pictures on the insured crops, farmers engage directly in the insurance process, which improves trust. The scheme requires champion farmers to take photos of farmers' crops at different growth stages, which are used by agronomists and insurance companies to determine if conditions warrant a payout. Using satellite and smartphone imagery, the picture-based insurance scheme addresses the challenges of discrepancies between insurance payouts and actual farmer losses. Picture-based insurance project is funded through the second phase of the Cultivate Africa's Future Fund, CULTIF, a joint program of IDRC and the Australian Centre for International Agricultural Research, ASIR. CULTIF supports research to achieve long-term food security in Eastern and Southern Africa. Since its inception in 2019, PBI has covered 8,480 farmers, 65% of them being women. To date, more than 4,000 farmers have received insurance payouts. Crop insurance combines advisory services with access to high-quality certified seeds. But how does the policy work? And what does it entail? Well, for an acre of land, insurance cover worth 200 Kenya shillings provides a payout of up to 2,000 Kenya shillings in the event of weather-related crop loss, which helps farmers recover the initial investment paid to buy seed. In the 2021 short rains, 87 policies were sold, increasing to over 5,000 policies by the long rains. By 2022, among the women who were offered the policy, 68% took up the product. The project has also provided evidence that farmers are willing to pay a higher premium if insurance is bundled with agricultural inputs and if payouts are made directly into mobile money accounts.